Hey folks, this is Red Falcon, and this is episode 12 of my Let's Play of a Crime Mercenary series. In our last episode, we um, did a spying mission, and we tried to take down a capital ship, but failed, so we had to get some allies to help us out with that. But uh, now we're in the Sierra system, which is hostile, which is why I'm docked in the Sierra station right now. And... Uh, We've just been giving a, given a job from the guild to eliminate enemy ace in the area. So, let me go ahead and do a quick save here. Pay my docking fee. Um, we'll do a quick look at what they have here. Fulcrum drive, repair system, cargo scanner, fuel converter, shield boost, cannon relay system. Ah, uh, you know what? I should have sold this cannon somewhere else. Mm. Oh well. Alright. Let's go take a look at that contract. Alright, and we need to eliminate an enemy ace, EGN. And destroy the ships flying with him. Now, because this is hostile space... Um, we're going to have a lot of people shooting at us. Okay, so All right, let's try to find this guy. There he is. All right. Now we're going to back up a little bit here. We'll see how good this ace is. And he's a member of the guild, so we're going to try to take out guild fighters. Because there's probably like some alliance and navy mixed in here too. And we don't want to shoot those guys. Because one, they'll hate us even more. And two, we don't want to waste valuable resources, but our time. There we go. That is also a guild member. Go. Ah! Come on, girl. Whoa! Capital ship! Where'd you come from? Holy! Good God! I need to get out of here. Alright, full power to the shields. Wow, I've got 3% hull strength. Good grief. Do I still have an engineer on board? Please tell me I have an engineer left. Okay, good. I did pick up an engineer. You know what? You're earning your pay. Take all my money. Here, take it. Take it all. Okay, good. Wow. I, I don't know how I survived that. Good grief. That was... That was intense. Alright. What the? Why? Why do these capital ships keep popping up? I'm just trying to make a living here. Okay. Okay. I think I can actually leave and repair. Well, there's two things I can do. I can wait until uh, my ship's repaired by itself. Or I can dock, pay a repair fee, and come back. Now, if you ever have to leave a mission, um, you'll notice there's a little square right there. That's your mission marker. So you can mark your mission and... Um, Transport back. Not transport back, but fly back. Oh, and I'm going to come into the... Oh, uh, my approach to the station is going to be all wonky. Yep. No 
problem. Kick her into IDS. Alert, inbound missile. Practice our maneuvers. Alright, pay the docking fee and enter station. Okay, we're good. Okay, so let's repair this ship. We took a lot of damage. I might as well refuel too while we're here. Alright. I really wish I had sold that Phantom Cannon. Because they were offered like 40000 for it. Oh well. I mean, not that I'm hurting for cash. I have $15 million, but still. That's not the point. <laughs> Docking track to be disengaged. Oh. There we go. Alert. Inbound zone. Okay, so let's try to avoid those cap ships. <laughs> okay. Where'd they go? Right, let's try heading in this direction. See what happens. Yeah, that was a really close call. I. Wow. Ah. Oh. This guy's friendly. Maybe he'll help me. Um. Yeah, I might as well show you this, too. You can actually. Uh, I remember I was talking earlier about um, hiring uh, wingmen. What you can do is uh, once you get within, like, a thousand. Units, you what can open up a trade. Did you have in mind? And you can actually trade with these people. Um, but uh, the important thing is you can actually hire him to join your wing. Oh, he's left. Oh, there's the Star Master, okay. He's flying the same ship as me. Alright. Oh, and if you're in IDS mode, um, you can hit M and it'll match the your speed with the target. You can also hit the F button and you can form up on him. Well, let's get a little closer to him. F4. What kind of trade did you have in mind? And you can actually sell stuff to them. Oh, come on. But the important thing is, if you hit the... Uh, um, the hire button, you can hire them to join your, uh, your, um, your wing. And he can be your wingman, and you can issue what orders to him. So, hire for fleet. Okay, now I assign these keys myself. And if you actually go into options, configure controls, right here, I believe it's on page three. Here you go. Um, send order form up. Uh, defend me, attack hostiles, mine asteroids, reload, refuel, and dismiss. Um, those are your wing orders. So I assigned enter to attack hostiles, plus sign on the keypad is defend me, form up is the minus sign, and refuel reload is the backslash key. Basically um, when you're near a station you can tell them to refuel and reload and they'll uh, replenish their missiles and fuel, which you'll have to do. So let's get him to form up on me. Navy, 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 Navy. Oh crap. Okay. Navy command. Navy. You know, I think I actually lost that. 
I missed a couple guild. Alright. Defend me! Alright, so let's see. Where's this guild guy at? He's in the middle of all this mess. Crap, 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 full power to the forward shield. Full power to the forward shields. Okay, get out of here. Wow, I really took a beating. That engineer's got his work cut out for him. Okay, that probably wasn't the best maneuver. Alright, full power to the shields. Alright, we're good. I hate fighting in hostile space because there's so many... Ugh, my weapon systems are down too, so we're gonna have to wait. Good news is though, I've got an engineer on board, so he's, he's earning his keep. Crew management. Alert, inbound missile. He's definitely getting a lot of job experience, too. Okay, now my weapons are hit, so... All that does is uh, prevent your weapons from firing. Okay. I don't think that wingman's alive. I think he just died. Yeah. That wasn't worth the 63,000 credits I paid him. Okay, that Phoenix might be a problem. We'll see. Okay, weapon systems at 50%. Let's head back to this nav point. Those missiles shouldn't hit us. Energy. And I, and I like that. Oh, wait, there's a Star Master. He's still. Huh, he's actually forming up on me. That's pretty cool. Alright, attack hostiles. I know, it's not necessary to say the command out loud. I like saying it, because it's fun. Alert, Let me have my fantasy, damn it. IDS. Okay, so now we need to find... Okay, there's another guildy. Enemy guildy, I should say. Maybe it's a rival guild? I don't know. I, I don't really understand the factions in this game all that well, so... Ooh, a mammoth. Thrust and boom. Okay, that wasn't enough. Okay, so that's another guild gone. So okay, there must be another guild. There's the other guild member. Okay. Okay, once these missiles decide that I'm um, not worth their time, I'm gonna. Swing back and take out the other guy. Should be sufficient for what I need to do. 
Hey, there's the Star Master. At least I think that's him anyway. Or maybe it's a different Star Master. I don't know. I'm pretty much... I'm pretty sure he's dead by now. Alright. Ah. That missile's probably too far. Yeah, that missile's too far. But yeah, this is what it's like fighting these uh, these ships in hostile space. It's it's a pain, it really is. I might as well tell my people to defend me. And this is another reason I got a uh, a larger fuel tank. So I can actually, uh, you know, last out here. Alert, inbound missile. Okay, he's dead. So. Oh, there's a guildy in there. Okay, there's the guildy. Okay. I need to take out that guy. And you know, I hate to say it, but I might have to retry this mission. If I kill all these guildies and the mission doesn't um, conclude. It's probably because I left the mission area. Yeah, Guardian. A Guardian's a higher, a, a larger frame, so that should be the guy we're looking for. God, I really wish I had a Fulcrum Torpedo right now. I could take all these guys out in one shot. At the cost of two grand, two million. I always feel a little dirty when I use a weapon like that, though. Alright, guard. Hey, we did it! Yes! Huzzah! Okay. Okay, so let's see. Now that we're in the war zone, we've been fighting. Venari. Blah, blah, blah. Venari's an alien race, I believe. Gain much of the advantage over. I'll have access initially. Okay, so basically he's saying that if we serve in a war zone, it'll increase our military rank and we'll have access to better equipment and military ships and all that stuff. Okay. We've still got a little time in this video. Let's, uh... Let's go ahead and dock, not dock, but uh, head to the Sierra War Zone. All right, let's get our get our neutral pitch. Let's go. But yeah, so we learned that we can leave. Hey, it's my Star Master friend. He's still with me. Awesome. Always good to fly with a wingman. And I don't know how long they stay with you. I haven't tested that, but you know. Long enough, I guess. Okay, so now we're in the Sierra War Zone. And this is the carrier. We'll go ahead and order our wingman to uh, reload and refuel. While we're 
here. Okay, now we get to land on a carrier, and our carrier is right over there. I think... If we set our heading to zero, adjust our pitch, neutral pitch. Hit the jump button. Hit the jump button. <laughs> It's either zero or one, one eighty. Whoa, one eighty. It was one eighty. Okay, that was the bow of the ship. Okay, so ah, come on. There we go. Okay, so make sure if you want to dock with a state with a, a carrier, you set your uh, heading to 180. But um, the dock on the carrier is on the bow of the ship. I'm sorry, the stern of the ship bows, bows the front. For those who don't know nautical terms, I always get port and starboard confused too. Any of you guys know a good way to remember uh, the difference between port and starboard? Let me know in the comments below. Okay, so we're going to dock with this station, or this carrier, I should say. And then I'm going to end the episode, and we're going to start our new episode in this war zone and do some war zone missions. And I'm going to explain the importance of rank and reputation. So uh, if you enjoyed this episode, please the, click the like button and leave a comment below. And... If you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. And as always, thank you for watching.